So here we go. We're going to try to actually go somewhere in our war against the Greeks. The Greeks are big geeks, and honestly, I'm going to have to start stockpiling some more troops because they just keep killing off my musketeers as they try to claim territory. So I need to get a few of them up there, hold some ground, and then bring in the reinforcements in the Dragoons. We'll see if I can actually pull this off. I do have railroad leading right up to it, so I can get troops there in a hurry if I have them. And as I've said before, engineers are a huge key when it comes to fighting a war, as is a healthy bank account. Just being able to purchase troops when you need them is fantastic. It makes or breaks your war a lot of the time. Don't be afraid to spend all your money on troops and then hold money for a turn or two, then just unleash a holy torrent of hell upon your foes. Even if you're just sending, you know, musketeers or dragoons or maybe some, uh, some ships, you know, something to harass them on the coast because ships make great, uh, loose troop killers. Like, they'll have troops out and about looking for you on a war. If you can wipe out those troops with your ships, it leaves your ground forces unoccupied to deal with their own issues, which is trying to take cities. And again, you can use the ships to soften up cities. It, it really is just, it's a strategy that's amazing. Especially if they lack the coastal fortresses, which they do. Oh, they do. It's fantastic that they are totally, woefully, all ill-prepared for the clads of iron. The nads of iron? No, no. We must find a cure for cancer. I wonder who's going to find the cure for cancer. Which one of you lucky people is it going to be? And I know, you must be getting bored. It's with all the same cities on the main island that get to build everything, but... I got news for you. They're the ones that have the best production. So, of course, they're going to be the ones doing it. You newer guys are really more for fighting uh, military battles. So, whatever your thing is, if you wanted wonders, which is what I'd prefer, honestly. Or, you just kind of want your own little dealio in that you want to be a military might. And that's what some people like. So be it. So be it. Oh, here comes B dude. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight, Sold! Wait, what was it? Oh, see, there I am being careless with ironclads. I really treat them badly. It's because I think they're invincibles. And I, no matter how poor their health is, ah, screw it. They can just keep fighting. And this is what you call overkill on the seas. Because I'm just going to change these all to ironclads and just pour all my money into it. And meanwhile, that catapult just seems to be sitting there going, Kill me! Kill me! Kill me! And then I got myself in trouble with an elephant. So, oh well. That's the way the world works sometimes. Not much you can do about it. Seriously, there's really not much you can do about it. All I know is that this place is in trouble. Assuming they don't have too many troops, they in trubs. TGI trubs. Thank God it's Trubs Day. Yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about. That's just insane. Plastic Allen, building stuff. How dare he? He th might think he's a real city if he keeps this up. Yo Sniper is another one. He needs the, the upgrades from, like, factories and the stuff that comes along later to increase your production even more. He needs that stuff. Like, a fat kid needs to get away from cake. That's right. Cake. No, I said cake. Seriously. I didn't say cow. You almost got me to do it. Damn you people. I think you're so smart. Making me say words I don't want to say. Oh, I'm on to your tricks and tribulations and trials of trialness. And again, sentences that don't make much sense. But whatevers. Alright, let's get more dragoons on the rick roll. And see right here. Watch this. Ooh, blasted them and I get a free veteran status. That's beautiful. It's so beautiful, it is. And now I'm just going to do the coast thing again, make sure I'm alright. And shoot the archer and almost die. Damn archers, they have decent defense. Can't fault the archers. And now we're just kind of setting up Permagon for a three-way attack, assuming the Permagon's not going to immediately massacre uh, one of my troops that aren't fortressized outside of their place. It's possible. I wouldn't put it past them. They're, they're, they're a bit of jerkus malerkuses like that. Oh, and if you're ever desperate, say you really want to bring an extra troop, you can always use uh, engineers to uh, 
to fortify a city temporarily. Because they have a defense of two. They can, they can actually hold up okay for a while. But, yeah, it's not a long-term solution. You should probably only do it if they'll, if they'll have a replacement ready in a turn or two. And you just really want to bring that extra troop in to uh, screw with the enemy. It might be enough to tip the scales in your favor. 40 million YouTubes. Wow, we're coming along. YouTubers, YouTubes, YouTube, the country of YouTube. Yeah, the country of YouTube is expanded. Just like the real YouTube. Wow, 34 more shields. That's pretty awesome. Soon we'll get a, two free discoveries. The one that we're researching and then another one. And then we'll be good to go. It's always nice to get a freebie or five. Of that much, I assure you. Scatha 5, joining the fight. So many people joining the fight. They don't know what they're signing up for. All they know is that service guarantees citizenship. Although I'd like to think my record's a little better than the mobile infantry. But who knows? Maybe it isn't. Alright, Engineer Dude. We got Dragoons coming. Now they're in trouble. That's going to be four brand spanking new Dragoons. Ready to join the Fizzite. That's right. I use words I would never speak. Wait. Wait, what? Who? Oh, Delphi. You are in trouble. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Yeah, Permagon's about to be mine. It's going to be permanently gone. And people have been wondering, am I going to rename the cities I take? No. I don't rename cities I take because I keep the name there so the citizens will remember every day that they used to be free and, you know, faithful supporters of the Greek uh, Empire. And they will have to live with the fact that I now dominate them because I am better than them. They will be the second class citizens that they deserve to be. And also, I'm too lazy to rename them. But mainly the second point. Mainly the second point. Plus, I just find it funny. I'm just an ass. They both work. Honestly. They really, really, really do. And I am better than ice cream, I assure you. Seriously. Even on a hot day. Alright, cure for cancer. Pigfish99, go! Of course, I'm trying to avoid pollution, so I knocked out a bunch of his stuff there. Because, um, that's how I roll. But what can you do? What can you do? I'll tell you what you can do. You can keep expanding, keep building, and more, most importantly, because most is a word, you know, keep destroying Greek forces. Now, this is... Oh, you stupid elephant. I'm trying to set this up so I can finally make some progress here. That'll do nicely. I want to get in here and set up a fortress, uh, sorry, fortification, so... Actually, it might even be a fortress, who knows. I just want to make it so that I can stack some troops and finally get ready to bust that place's face. It's been a thorn in my side, it's a choke point. They've been holding me back on that one spot. That's why they've been able to hold me so long. They've been bringing troops in from other cities. Oh, that was so close, I almost got a, a kill there. That would have been huge. Speaking of kills, oh, you got killed. Killed hard. Hard. Ready, hurry, herd. And in the meantime, we'll just keep on expanding our railroads all over the place because that's how we like to do it. Now here's a nice little trick. You don't want to send an injured guy towards uh, a new place like that. We want to send the uh, healthy guy. Oh, come on. Yes, Delphi is exposed to attack. Oh, man. The Greeks are starting to feel it now. They're starting to get worried. They're, they're thinking, wait a minute, wait, wait a minute. What, what's going on? We've lost Marathon. We lost, you know... Baragi, and now we're in Herkalakalakajaka, is going to be lost, and they bombarded three of our cities clean of troops, and they lost Permagon, and Parmesan, and, and Swiss, and Monterey Jack, and, you know, Brie Little Cheese, and, wait, okay, I'm thinking about cheese now, how did that happen? Well, you know, I got cheese on the brain. It's not a bad thing, it's a good thing. Also a good thing? building sewer system so filth no longer fills the streets. King Cool, I'm converting your production into trade by use of capitalization. Makes a little more money for yourself. I don't want him building any wonders right now. I've got enough people building wonders. I don't need to worry about that. And there's not a lot of great wonders coming for a while. Like, there's, they're not coming, period. All the, the more recent wonders are awesome, but we'll have to wait for a time. And Jack Productions GC gets knocked out of Jack Productions. Good for him. Good for him. Bomb that. Yes. Bomb that. 
do it. Destroy... No, don't buy dragoons. We don't need dragoons. That's right, we need musketeers now. We need a little bit of garden power for our garden. Guarding power. My goodness. Garden power might do it too. Oh, I don't think so. I don't think so. They're blocking me. And they're blocking... Oh, this is unfair. Okay, kill him. Excellent. It is amazing. We are ready to destruct and destroy. Oh, it's going to be awesome. Oh, man, it's going to be sweet. I can hardly wait. I can hardly wait to do it. It's going to be so awesome. At any second now, the cannons will open fire and they will die. Or maybe we should just build it up for tomorrow. What do you think? I think some silence is a good way to go out. Because that's the sound the Greeks be making when they're dead. <laughs>